So if we read this sentence correctly, thanks to his offer, whoever his was, uh, you know, some Jamie apparently, uh, I was able to meet several times with the following consultants. Liz, Liz, that woman. Uh, well, Lynn, uh, as it were, I want to go at least and do a little bit more displaying of who she is. Now, one thing I want to take note of is if I hit tab, Notice where my cursor goes. It goes right over here. Well, what's actually happening, just so we can see that, is if you were to just follow the cursor up, I'm going to go to every next, or I'm going to go to the next sort of 0.5 inch mark. So I promise you, I guarantee you, if I hit tab again, I'm going right about here. What do you know? That's exactly about where I said I would. Now, if I type in hi, hi hello now I'm not gonna go five spaces I'm actually gonna go to the next nearest half inch mark which should be right about roughly there that's where I am so one of the things we can do is we can introduce something known as a tab stop now a tab stop what it does is it's explicitly controlling where that tab goes instead of just going here to the one, what I would like to do is I want to maybe have it appear all the way at the six or the five. Uh, I want to say the six because what I want to happen is I want Lynn to be on uh, this side of my paper, but I want to cover up some white space. So I'm going to put uh, Lynn's title over here. So what I can do is now all of a sudden I'm going to just go up to this ruler. If you don't have the ruler, you can come to your view tab and check the ruler and I'm going to get rid of navigation pane while I'm here just so we can see a little bit better and now all of a sudden I'm just gonna go over to right about here at the six mark and I'm gonna click on it notice what happened it jumped now this is always an issue uh, you've probably had this happen to you in the past where you might see that there's a little L there a teeny tiny little L oh no it's, oh, it's such a shit all I have to do is click hold. Notice how I get a line there. I drag it off. As soon as I let go of my mouse, it goes away. So that's a nice little effect. But I want to go a little one step further. I want to go ahead and open up my paragraphs button. Now inside the paragraphs dialog box, you're going to see that I have a tabs button. Inside the tabs button, I have exactly what we've been talking about tab stop position tab stop position tells me explicitly where to put my tab now I said I want to put it at the six inch mark so six double quote now you see on the next little section I have something called alignment right now it's set to left alignment but you know just because it's so close I don't want to I don't want to worry about the fact that I might roll over too much I'm just gonna say no instead I'm gonna give it the right alignment now if you've ever kind of opened up a textbook uh, say for example I got a textbook conveniently right beside me it's almost as if I'm reading from the book one thing you want to take note of is look at those table of contents there we are. Notice how there's dots there. Those dots are known as dot leaders. They're basically these guys. And so if I set this to two, now I'm going to hit set. Nothing looks like it's happened yet. Okay. Notice what happened. All of a sudden I get these dots everywhere. And uh, okay, Lynn, what was her uh, title? Well, she was an associate consultant, aka she's a big you can see again now if I want to adjust this I can actually see this I can actually click hold and drag it in notice I can bring it up really close or really far away and so I can actually make it sort of I can take it all the way to the edge that's pretty nice all right well what happens if I want to do it again well I hit enter so let's say it's me Adam Guida Ooh, look at that now I have it, and because I'm the uh, man, uh, lead consultant. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, I'm the man. But this allows for me to now have multiple P 
people. And so I can add in another person like uh, uh, Burt Reynolds. And uh, he was the, uh, uh, he was a lead consultant as well because it's Burt Reynolds for Pete's sake. Uh, as long as you make sure to properly spell lead consultant.